Feud of the Year. The nominees, CM Punk vs. Paul Heyman, The Shield vs. Team Hell No, Daniel Bryan vs. Randy Orton, CM Punk vs. Mr. Dwayne Johnson himself, The Rock, AJ Styles vs. Bully Ray, and The Rhodes Family vs. The Authority. None. Yeah, I... I, I pick none of them. I, I, I know what you're saying here, because to be honest, I don't think there have been any really strong feuds this year. Um, you know, you look at like CM Punk versus The Rock. I mean, it had a great moment with The Rock finally uh, winning the WWE title again. You had that special moment, but um, you know their matches weren't really you know at that level. Well, they could have been because it was CM Punk and The Rock. Yeah, but I mean they they did have some great promos. So I mean, I mean, I might go with CM Punk versus The Rock. Um, CM Punk and Paul Heyman had great promos, but not you know there weren't any really memorable matches there. You had CM Punk against Ryback and Curtis Axel. And, you know, none of those were all that good. Shield and Team Hell No had a lot of very memorable matches. But theirs were more toward the end of last year, early part of this year. It wasn't yeah. all year. Yeah. Honestly, I made my pick on my notes. I'm going to make sure I read this right. Cause make sure I got this right. And I, I enjoyed okay. Rhodes Family versus Authority, but I mean, that was so short. It only went for about a month or well, so. Well, I, I noticed you have Daniel Bryan versus Randy Orton as a nominee. I think the nominee should have been in that category, Daniel Bryan versus The Authority. Because you remember, Bryan was even feuding with Vince for a while. Triple H just kind of teasing a babyface turn against Vince, yeah. going into SummerSlam to help Bryan, and he did, and then he turned on Bryan, and you know the whole McMahon family, including Vince, rallied against Bryan. So I think Daniel Bryan versus The Authority, in my opinion, is the feud of the year. All right, well, from... Based on this list. Based on right? this list right here, I'm going to go with CM Punk versus Paul Heyman. All right, well, um, you know, I think I'm going to have to go with The Shield versus Team Hell No just because of the quality of the matches. You know, match after match was really great between those two teams and whoever was partnered up with Team Hell No. So, you know, that that's my pick based on the quality of the matches. Okay.